So I have been getting um, questions in my inbox about um, why I decided to become a single mom by choice and what is her ethnicity. <laughs> ethnicity. Um, so first, why I became a single mom by choice, um, I already have a 13-year-old son. Um, once I had him, I was like, you know, we're, we're good. Um, I'm good with um, just me and him. But um, in 2020, I actually was in a relationship or situationship, something. And I became pregnant with my second son. Unfortunately, um, January 2021, I lost him due to incompetent cervix um, and my water broke. So um, after that, I really just was like, okay, I really wanted another child. But my situation relationship ended. And so I decided that, you know, being that I turned 40 and last year and no prospects <laughs> at that time of a relationship or anything or marriage or anything like that, I decided I'm going to do this on my own. So that's exactly what I did. I actually went through three rounds of IUI because my insurance covered it, um, but they didn't work. So I went through IVF to conceive her. Um, as I don't know where this top is, <laughs> as far as her ethnicity, um, I wanted an African-American donor. However, it was like trying to find a needle in a haystack. Um, there's not that many. And then on top of that, I, after all the testing, Lord, we cannot keep socks. Um, after all the testing that I've done, that I did for IVF, I ended up being um, CMV negative. I'm not really sure what CMV, what it is, but I wasn't exposed to it or I hadn't been exposed to it. So I had to choose a CMV negative donor. With that being said, that made um, the search even smaller. So her donor is actually Arabian, Lebanese, in that genre. Um, so her donor is kind of olive skin tone. So I figured with my melanin, his olive skin tone, she would get a little color to her um, maybe later on. But right now she is light skin um, and it's fine. I, you know, I'm going to love her either way. So that is why I became a single mom by choice.